In the service on Sunday, I connected the TED talk we used as our reading with the Buddhist practice of right speech. In the talk, uh, Maysoon Zayed, a Palestinian woman, a stand-up comic living with cerebral palsy, says that she's overcome many things in her life. She walks even though doctors said she wouldn't because she had a support of a community. She mentioned her father would say to her the words, you can do it, yes you can can. She remembers those words. She also says that she doesn't know if she would be the person she is today or even walk if when she was growing up she had seen and heard the kind of words that she's seen about her on the internet. Here we are in an age where you're probably watching this video on YouTube or Facebook where social media and the internet are able to take words that we write or say and send them around the world almost immediately. It's hard enough growing up as a middle schooler or a teenager or being an adult in the world without an increased power to our words. It may be more important than ever for us to be mindful of one of the most powerful tools we have in changing human lives, our speech. So on Sunday we asked is what I'm about to say true? Is it helpful? Is it necessary? And is it kind? All on the assumption that our words have the power to build the world that we're living in. And so we're curious to hear from you. When have words changed your life? What do you do that helps you be more mindful in using one of the most powerful tools we have to build the world? We're interested in hearing from you.